adventure. We're boarding an airplane and going to a beautiful island. Once we get to the island, we're gonna get on the boat and do an awesome fishing, diving, and exploring adventure. We're also super excited to be teaming up with our friends Kenson and Rashad from Staniel K Adventures. They know all the best spots in the area and they're gonna show us an amazing time. I've never spearfished before, never used the Hawaiian sling or anything for that matter. So this should be a, a, an interesting learning experience. Yeah. Hold here up, hold back, release. Okay. Where does the rubber part go? Around your elbow? Right oh, here. your wrist. Your, uh, in front of your thumb. So you release. Okay. What do I get if I catch a lobster with just my hands? <laughs> He's laughing at me. You get a review. You get a what? <laughs> really? Yep. I'm just kidding. Oh god! Oh, he took it back. Oh man, I was gonna really try. Leave me a diver for the rest of your life. Okay, deal. That's a deal. <laughs> I have to catch one by hand. Yep. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna try to catch one just by using my hands. Gotta get gloves. Though. I got my gloves. All right, going in. I got my gloves. I'm trying to win a fishing guide for life. Uh -huh. Fingers crossed. So what I get? <laughs> what should he get if I don't catch one with hands? Ooh, I don't know. Yeah. What do you got? <laughs> yeah, what do you want? <laughs> I will cook you a lobster that you catch. How about that? She's a really good cook. All right, we just finished dropping at the first spot. I didn't catch anything, but our guy right here he caught a lobster and a fish. What kind of fish? That's a snapper. I went after them, but they were too fast for me. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't even swim as fast. So we're gonna go to the second spot right now. Drop down and it's actually a little shallower here. So I'll see if I can get one this time.
Got a grouper. <laughs> Let I call you dinner. Oh, it just swallowed some salt water. Wow, that's huge! Oh my god! <laughs> that's a huge one! How'd you even see him? I didn't see him. Wow. You got him? Don't let him go, he's pretty strong. <laughs> There's a crab in there. Yeah. What kind of crab is that? Stone crab. Oh wow. You don't spear those? Okay. No. You saw the crab. You didn't see the crawfish. I saw the crab, but the first dive I didn't see anything. Then after you spear the crawfish. I saw this massive crab. Yeah. <laughs> You're allergic to lobster? Yeah. So what kind of fish do you like? I eat every other shellfish besides well, conch, shrimp. Okay, let's yeah. see if we can see some conch. All right, we're approaching the money spot. This is where all the lobsters are. All of them? Hopefully. Yeah. So you saw a big creeper in there, but it went in pretty deep, so I think he's out of reach. That's the biggest one so far. Yep. <laughs> Yeah. So, so far we got a couple of lobsters, two trigger fish. There it is right there. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello. The sharks are in the water waiting for us to clean the fish so they can have the snacks for lunch. The scraps for lunch. Oh my god, so annoying. Alright, we made it to the fillet station. Yep. <laughs> Look at that. A lot of fish have been filleted here. You look like a superstar, just catch these lobsters. Yeah, I didn't catch these by myself. <laughs> I won't lie. Yeah, for 
Chalet. Ooh. Let's go right here. Oh man. I'm scared. Ready? Ready. Oh <laughs> it's like a vacuum. Look at these cottages guys so we're staying in this pink one but there's all different ones one bedroom two bedroom ours is a two bedroom it's very close to the water very close to the yacht club very close to the airport everything's pretty close on this island because it's very small oh, yeah. right, let's go get some supplies and then we could cook our lobster up You can take women out of Europe, but you can't take Europe out of women. It's <laughs> very true. The most European thing we could possibly do right now. <laughs> <laughs> right in the back of a pickup truck with garbage. Hi. Hi. Hello, how are you? So you want to talk to Bardak? You don't think Bardak can get it? You don't think Bardak can get it open? Butter? Butter is probably in the fridge. Butter right there, Alright, what do you call Butter for the lobster. You got everything? Yeah. Uh -huh. Thank you for opening for us. No yes. problem. We um, went lobster Ready. diving and caught lobster and grouper. So. Oh, you're all smart. So good in them for you. Um, our friend Kenton. Oh, Kenton. Kenton. That's my nephew. That's your nephew. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Kenton, yeah. we have your aunt here. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All He's right. very good. He taught me how to spearfish today. Yeah, well, that's good. That's good. Uh huh. If you hold one box, I'll hold the other. <laughs> We've got our groceries. Have you ever been grocery shopping like this before? Yes. We're good. <laughs> Before we continue with the adventure, I'd like to first stop and thank Husk for sponsoring today's video. Husk knives are made from high quality Japanese steel. This knife features a hygienic rustic style handle and a 38 degree blade edge that ensures extreme sharpness. Husk knives come out of the box razor sharp and they'll stay that way for years. The curved blade with a grip hole enables better precision in handling to make chopping and cutting actions easier. This knife is safe and sturdy. The sharp blade ensures the knife won't slip from applying unnecessary force, which could result in injury. These Japanese knives are light and durable, measuring 28 centimeters in length and weighing in at 252 grams, which increases comfort and control. A great knife can revolutionize your daily meal prep, and it's so much better to have one good one rather than several cheap ones, which will dull and rust with time. If you guys are interested in trying these knives, you can click the link in the description box down below. Husk is currently running a 70% discount for my viewers with a 30 day money back guarantee. So be sure to check it out because this deal won't last long. Thank you so much Husk for sponsoring today's video. Now let's get back to the adventure. All right guys, we're back in our cottage. We have the lobster tail and the grouper right here. I just put the stove on, the butter's melting. Let's go ahead and put the fish in there and cook up an amazing meal. Get some salt and, of course, some pepper. Look at this. Just salt and pepper. That's all it's gonna need. 
And we're gonna cook it shell side down first. This way the juices kind of catch in the shell and it kind of cooks in its own juices. It's gonna be so good. Look how sharp this knife is, it's freaking crazy. We used it for filleting. And this one's a little thick for filleting, but it worked really well and it just slices into everything. Fruit, watermelon, fish. And it went right through this lobster shell, which was extremely hard. Ooh. Look at that lobster. I'm gonna grab it and sizzle it down. Woo! Ooh, it looks amazing. Right? It's huge. And this is the grouper. Grouper, I hardly know her. <laughs> Wow, it's just like falling apart so tender. <laughs> Look at this mountain of lobster. We didn't make any sides because we're not going to be here long. We're leaving tomorrow and we don't want anything to go to waste. So we're just eating what we caught today. Oh my god, look at this piece. Look at that. It's huge. It's like the biggest mm, wow. chunks. You like it? That is so good. That's probably the best lobster I've ever had. Yeah, I'm not just saying that because I made it. It's very, very good. So the grouper and the lobster. <laughs> oh. That's a big one. Look at that meat. I've never seen lobster meat like that. It's flaky. It's flaky and like it's right like right off the bone. Extremely like white, like really fresh. Mm. If you guys are ever in the Bahamas, Exuma specifically, be sure you check out Staniel K Adventures. They're the ones who took us out today and showed us an amazing day out on the water. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you've enjoyed this adventure with us. Give it a thumbs up if you did, subscribe if you're new, buy the merch if you want to support the channel, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye. I was wondering where there's one more bug in. Every time. <laughs> Couldn't need those divorce papers signed. Catch and cook and have Lena yell at you for. <laughs> 40 minutes straight. <laughs> the door! The door!